All right, Christmas came early this year. This is my brand new uh, all-electric two-stage snowblower. It's made by the uh, company Snowjo, and my wife let me go out last night and pick this up. This is a this is a beast of a machine. <laughs> uh, the the beautiful thing is, I mean, it being an electric snowblower, but it's a two-stage unit, and this is going to help us uh, greatly in the winter to clear snow in the driveway. We originally had purchased a uh, snowblower several years ago f through the same company, Snowjo, and that's uh, this unit over here. But it's just a single stage unit, and although it's done a good job, it is quite hard after repetitive snowfalls week after week and the more intensive storms that uh, we can occur here in Maine. It's, it's a great little unit, but uh, it's, it's time that we've upgraded and so we did so here here it is that's the uh new snowblower so i'm going to uh and it also uses two batteries which is amazing so like this on my original one it uses one battery it's a 40 volt battery okay and i believe that one was a four amp battery for this unit over here however it's the same style battery but it's a five amp and it uses two so instead of 40 volts you're combining that voltage and you're getting 80 volts out of it so so that's uh that's pretty cool this is this is definitely a lot beefier than the the other one i mean i can't even lift this one where as with this one i could i could easily lift this with one hand so that that's not too heavy and that's great if you need something that's like portable but this one i'm, I'm not going to be uh lifting anywhere anytime soon <laughs> Alright, so I'm back inside. That was fun. I have to say, that was the first time in a long time that I actually enjoyed clearing snow from the driveway. That thing's got some power to it. And that's thanks to the dual 40 volt batteries that the snowblower uses. As you can see, I've got them back on the charger here and they're all charged up. Let me take one of these off so you can see here. So this is the, the battery that it comes with. And it's a 40 volt, 5 amp hour lithium ion battery. So, by using two of those and getting 80 volts, the two-stage snowblower works so much better than the single stage. Now, with that said, I did use my single stage. Here's the uh, battery for that. Pretty much the same thing. It's just it's 4 amp hours instead of 5. But it's th I've had this one for, what, three years now? And here's my little uh, <laughs> power wall here. So, I'm going to go ahead and plug my original one back in and let that charge up because I did use that last. So, there we go. That's charging up again. But uh, yeah, I, I like the new snowblower for sure. It's definitely going to help out in uh, instances where we have large snowstorms or any time we get a snowstorm because the foot of the driveway, you need to be able to get through that packed in snow. And the single stage just doesn't do that. But I actually found it easier to use the single stage for, for everything else. When it comes to just clearing out lightly packed snow, the single stage, you can run through it in a breeze, and that's awesome. 
But for the heavier packed snow, like at the foot of the driveway, that's where you really need to have the dual stage snow blower. And then I also use this one to create a path leading out back to the backyard. So I do find a need for both of them, but it's so nice to have this dual stage snow blower because I just I can do so much more with it in the winter and get the job done quicker than I could ever do with this. And I don't have to use the shovels as much. Other than the steps, that's all I really need the shovels for now. What I used to do in the past was I would use the shovels and then I would chop it up at the end of the driveway so I could use the single stage snowblower here to plow through it. But now I don't have to do that. With the dual stage snowblower, I can just take on the foot of the driveway without any issues. And that's just, it's, it's awesome to be able to do that now. All right, so what's my overall thoughts on the dual stage snowblower? Personally, I love it, but a word of caution, if you live in a climate where you only get like maybe two or three inches every snowfall, uh, a dual stage snowblower is probably going to be a bit of an overkill for you, and it's probably not going to get the job done either. Uh, like I said, I found that it was much easier in this snowfall that we just had, uh, we only got the two or three inches, and I found it much easier to use my single stage snowblower to do the majority of the driveway. But at the end of the driveway, that's where it was really helpful. And I live in Maine, and we get snowfalls that are greater than two or three inches from time to time. <laughs> this was uh, an exception. It was our, one of our first uh, significant snowfalls, but that doesn't say much compared to what we normally get. We can get like six, eight, 12 inches at a time or more. And that's where a dual stage snowblower is really going to come in handy. Um, if you only get two or three inches, it's not going to pick up the snow like a, a single stage would. And if you're only getting two or three inches, honestly, I mean, let's be honest here, you can just use a shovel, and that's what I've done for most of the time before we even got this, the single stage that we got. Um, it's, it's like a love-hate relationship, you, and I can see the need for both. So I, at first I thought I was going to sell my uh, single stage snowblower and just hold on to the dual stage, but after uh, this first snowfall, I'm glad the snowfall that we got was just the two or three inches, because it just kind of proved the need to have both. Um, I could get rid of the single stage snowblower, but then I would be shoveling on all, the, all of those lighter snowfalls and just using the dual stage for the foot of the driveway. But, you know, if you live in Maine, you kind of need that kind of equipment. So having both doesn't bother me. And I know some people would be like, oh, you should, you should just have one that does it all. But I don't really think there's a uh, one that does all uh, situations. So, <laughs> Um, again, if, if you live in the south and you only get like two or three inches at most at any time throughout the season, it, it's a waste of money. Do not go for the dual stage. But if, if you, uh, if you want to get a, a single stage, I think that would uh, help you out if you don't want to shovel at all. Uh, up here in Maine, though, again, personally, I think a uh, dual stage and a single stage for those uh, lighter snowfalls is a good investment. So that's my thoughts on it. Uh, I hope this helps anyone who's looking to invest in either a single or dual stage snowblower. But uh, yeah, until next time, I'm Bill Hensley. Uh, please uh, like, uh, subscribe, and share, and I'll catch you later.